guys in this video i'm going to show you how you can cast anything in your oculus quest to your android or your iphone okay no matter the android or the iphone you can cast any of your activity right inside quest okay and everything you're doing inside quest will be showing in your phone so even if you want to teach somebody something in the quest you guys can see that I'm scrolling with my mouse. I don't know if you can see my screen. I'm scrolling, you can view everything. Scroll down, I'm right inside stock. This is dead horizon. Let me click on it. So whatever thing you're doing right inside quest, you can cast it to your iPhone or your Android phone, no matter the kind of Android phone or iPhone that you're using. You can cast it to your phone so i'm going to show you in this video how you can do that all right in just a um, couple of minutes you can cast anything that you're doing inside of this quest all right and you'll be watching it you can also record it by tapping the record button right here and the phone will be recording all your activity right inside the quest and it's quite very fast but the thing is your internet needs to be fast because you're doing this on a wireless basis so you definitely need a fast internet for you to cast it and for this to be very fast you guys can see that if i'm checking my head it's going at the same time so for you to do this you need a very fast internet for you to be able to cast it because it's wireless casting all right so you need you don't need to hotspot your phone to you know give your um oculus internet but your phone and your oculus has to be connected to um a router or a, a Wi-Fi, you know, modem or stuff like that, not a um, hotspot. So, the very first thing you need is just to connect your phone and your Oculus Quest to your um, Wi-Fi or your router. But before you do that, you, more, you guys know that for you to use Quest, you must have a Facebook account. Your original Facebook account, you have to log it in and. Um, in your quest once you log it in your quest now all you need is just come to your android okay now come to your android is that an android or um um apple store whichever way then initially it was oculus the app name was oculus but let's search let's see okay but well now it's now meta quest so is that you put oculus or you put the actual name meta quest just put meta quest which is the current name this is the application i already have it in my phone same thing with iphone there's no two ways all you need to do is just install it once you're done installing it open it and once you open it another thing you have to bear in mind is you you i have to stop casting all right i have to stop casting now let me go okay I've stopped casting so right so I'm right inside the app what you need to do is come over inside your Oculus Quest okay once you come over inside your Oculus Quest start recording let me record my screen so that I will show you guys how this is being done once you come inside your Oculus Quest and you want to cast whatever you're doing in your Oculus Quest to your phone, iPhone or Android, what you need to do is come to this video, click on video or camera, okay? What you need to do is just come to this camera, click on camera, once you click on camera, all right, so this window pops up. This is where you can see I'm recording. Now, all you need to do is just hit on um on cast once you hit on cast this is going to give signal to your phone once the phone is connected to the same network with the oculus quest all right so let me just um first of all close this app let me close this app and you can see this is the app all right now let me hit on cast right inside of this you can see available device 
MetaQuest mobile app or computer. You can also cast this to your laptop or your desktop or cast to your iPhone or your Android. But here I'm doing about, I'm, what I'm doing is Android and iPhone. And in my next video, I'm going to show you how you can cast it on your computer. Okay, now click on MetaQuest mobile app, which is for phone. Now hit on next. You can see it's now showing green. Now if you look at the phone, you can see that the phone also is now showing this red. It's now giving this um, red sign. Now click the MetaQuest this thing um, up and you can see click on cast. Right. Wait for some time. You can see is now casting. You guys can see that. I have now connected it. It's now casting to my um, phone. And I think the recording has already stopped because I was recording with my Oculus Quest before I hit on the um, cast. But I don't think that Oculus Quest can cast a record at the same time. So I think the video, the recording video stopped before I really I started casting the recording button stopped okay but at the same time you can also click on the record button here and you can see it has changed to red so i am now recording whatever activity that is going on you can also record it from here and you can also record it um, from your oculus quest so so it's quite very easy for you to cast anything that you're doing in your oculus quest in case if you want to teach your child anything about any application you can also cast it to your phone or your laptop while you're teaching that child because once that child is wearing that oculus quest device you might not be able to access whatever she or he is seeing inside that device so this is the only way you can see it and guide your child so that your child will understand everything you're trying to teach him or her or whoever even if it's not your child so in my next video I'm going to show you how you can cast to your laptop or your desktop and I'm going to put that video at the end of this video so in case if you would like to know how to cast on your laptop or your desktop anything you're doing in your office just to your laptop or your desktop make sure that you watch out the next video you're going to see at the end of this video and if you're watching my video for the first time my name is Asuke Nakinsley and on this channel I give you tips and solutions on how to make Another relevant thing that helps in our daily online space, but during the weekend, I make sure I come up with updates on new games and apps in the virtual reality space. So if you wouldn't want to miss any of my videos, make sure you turn on the notification button and make sure you hit the subscription button so that you'll be the first to know once I upload a new video. I will see you guys in my next video. Like always, you guys should stay creative and remain blessed.